you guys a couple updates of what's happening in my life and a lot of frequently asked questions that I'm getting on Twitter and Facebook and all that fun stuff. Um, so I thought I would give you guys an update on life, looks, love, and more. Um, so, first thing, I am single. Just putting that out there that I was dating someone, it's not anyone's fault, there's not any sort of cheating or drama with it, I'm just, I'm single. A lot of people were wondering and asking them, like, why are you posting pictures with all these guys and why are you flirting with everybody? It's, it's, I'm single, so I thought I would just put that out there and not a lot of drama to even go into. Um, and it's totally fine. I was friends with the guy I was dating and we're going to still be friends and that's all fine. So that's the first thing. First, I'm the realist. Second thing, yes, I know I have, like, a weird tan happening. All will be revealed with that in, in, in weeks of why I, all these different shades, um, of tan, <laughs> 50 shades of tan, um, and yes, I got new hair, my hair is my, um, of course, Valencia Rose, it is Russian hair this time, and it is a little shorter, it's 20 inches, but it actually ended up being really long, I think it gave me a couple extra inches, and I love it, in the 613, um, it hel it's held up really well, it holds a curl amazing, and it blends as far as I can tell uh, so far that this is the thickest. The Russian seems to be the thickest. It seems to be the most cooperative with my curls. It seems to hold the curls the best and I just am really, I'm really digging it. Second, I did get more lip injections. Uh, some people thought it was like overboard on my Instagram. It's when they were swollen is when I, I posted the pictures because I like them swollen. Uh, but as you can see, they have gone down and uh, I have to give a shout out to Cat at Cosmetic Care. If anyone is looking for any sort of med spa procedures, Cosmetic Care in Newport Beach, top notch. They do really natural looking fillers, injections, all that fun stuff. <laughs> fun stuff. And it's really relatively no pain. I love Kat so much. This is the second time she's done my lips and she just numbs it so much. If you tell her you're a little nervous about pain, she'll numb it so you don't even feel it. It's kind of awesome. I kind of love it. I'm kind of addicted and I just want to get more fillers. Um, so that's that with the looks. The tan, I think I've explained everything really well. Um, as you guys know, my short film viral video has come out and I'm so excited that you guys have been liking it for the most part. Um, and I just, uh, I've gotten a lot of uh, comments about um, kissing Richard Grieco. And uh, I think it's so cool, right? It's like, I've been obsessed lately with watching old 21 Jump Streets. Ever since I knew he was going to be part of this project, I, I, like, I researched people that I'm going to either work with or whatever. Uh, I researched him. You know, I knew him. It's so ironic. Talk about foreshadowing. Uh, someone, some of you pointed this out on my Instagram and Twitter, like, literally like eight weeks ago or maybe even more, I said I had a screen grab of Richard Grieco's part in A Night at the Roxbury, and I was like, my favorite part of the movie, Richard Grieco. Uh, I love that part of the movie and that's kind of how I knew him and I that's not an insult to him at all because it's like I mean I'm, I'm a blonde I don't know all these like old-time things but uh, not that he's old-time because he's still <laughs> oh my god I'm just like digging great I'm just saying like I knew him mostly from like Lifetime movies and A Night at the Roxbury um, not even knowing what he's most known for which is playing Dennis Booker in 21 Jump Street and I have been obsessed with 21 Jump Street he starts on season three and goes to the end and then he had like a spin-off of Booker and I've been obsessed with watching them because they're on YouTube and he's so freaking hot in those I mean he's hot in person like he's just hot and I mean he's hot period like now you guys know I like my older men so I just find men get better with age but he is so stinking hot now but then I watched back then and I'm like fuck me you know what I mean like hot 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 um he's just a good looking guy he's just a good looking dude he's just a lot leaner now he was just a little more meat head back then and now he's a little more leaner um but yes that kiss was real, and I'm, I'm so lucky. Ah. Uh, after watching 21 Jump Street, I was watching m most of it after we filmed it, so I didn't really, like, know at the time. But, uh, yeah, was he a good kisser? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's not really, it wasn't really a kiss. It was, like, a kiss that I wasn't supposed to be into. I was like, no, no, no. Meanwhile, I'm like, yes, yes, yes. Um, yeah, that, that's that. So if you guys want to see the kiss of that, of all that went down, he's an amazing actor and is awesome and made my video so awesome. I'm so honored that he was even, like, want, like, like accepted to be a part of it like my mind is still blown because it's like Richard Grieco you know what I mean I was like so excited so if you kids don't know you're younger than me so if you kids don't know go watch 21 Jump Street Dennis Booker yes and I am I'm a lush it is like it's literally guys it's literally like noon right now yeah it's literally like noon and I'm drinking vodka and cranberry or maybe just cranberry Trisha's 31 Nights of Fright was in the top 100 on Amazon which was so freaking cool thank you guys so much for making that happen um you can still definitely get the book 
and uh, I'll link that below. I have some really exciting news that I can't really announce quite yet, but literally days away from announcing, so stay tuned for that. But most importantly, I want to know what you guys want to see from me. Um, what kind of videos do you guys want? Because I am all about doing these big projects like viral video. I have some more big projects coming up and I want to do more of those uh, for selfish reasons because I, I find them uh, just artistically fulfilling. Um, but what do you guys want to see? I have gotten a lot of requests for hair and makeup tutorials again. I can do those. I know I get so much hate on them though, so it makes me scared. But I can totally do those for you guys if that's what you want. Um, uh, whatever you want. The Get Ready With Me seems to be pretty popular where I'm not really necessarily teaching you, but just kind of going you through my routine. Um, but if you want to see more beauty videos, let me know. If you want to see more themed videos, let me know. Holiday videos. If you want more epic productions, let me know. Um, I just kind of go based off of what I want to do and also what views. I can kind of tell what you guys like more. Um, and then for those of you who are missing my vlogs, uh, my daily follow me arounds, those are not on this channel. I've created a whole separate channel for that. It's called Trisha's Life. So check that out. And I think that's pretty much it, you guys. I think that's pretty much it. I kind of wanted to just sit down for a minute, film videos, say hi, talk one-on-one -on -one like this. I, I love these kind of interactions. I love doing big, big feature things and big production value things, but I love just talking to you guys one-on-one -on -one because I get the feedback, you get my feedback, we just, we just get each other. So, um, yeah, anyways, I hope you guys have been having an awesome fall season, and I hope, I hope you guys have been enjoying the videos and the content I've been putting out, and I just want to only do better and bigger things for you guys, and I don't, I don't ever want to get off YouTube. A lot of people are like, oh, you're going to do, like, movies? It's like, yeah, I, I kind of want to do other things, but, like, YouTube's my home. YouTube's my you guys are my home, you know what I mean? It makes me feel safe, it makes me feel comfortable because I know no matter what I put on this channel, the majority of you are going to love it and like it and be supportive of it and that oh, means the world to me. So anyways, that is going to do it for me. I don't know what that was all about right there. Um, but yeah, I will uh, link everything I talked about in the description box below and I want to say hi to Rick and Rannis and until next time, here are my kisses. My little, 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 my